Hey everyone and welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we're going to dive into one of Excel's powerful features, data validation. We'll be creating a drop-down list to ensure that the data entered into our spreadsheet is accurate and consistent. Let's get started. First, open your Excel workbook where you want to create the drop-down list. For this example, I'm going to use a sample spreadsheet. Next, we need to create the list of items that we want to appear in our drop-down. This can be on the same sheet or a different sheet. I'm going to enter my list on sheet 2. Here I've entered my list of items apple, banana, orange, and grape. To make this list easier to manage, especially if we want to add or remove items later, we can name this range. Select the range containing your list, go to the formulas tab, and click on define name. In the new name dialog box, enter a name of your range, such as fruit list, and click OK. Now go back to the sheet where you want the drop-down list to appear. Select the cell where you want the drop-down list, with the cell selected, go to the data tab on the ribbon, and click on data validation. The data validation dialog box under the settings tab, choose list from the allow drop down menu. The source field, tap an equal sign followed by the name of your range like this, equal fruit list. Once you've entered the name, click OK. Now click on the cell where you added the validation and you should see a drop down arrow. Click on the arrow and you'll see your list items. The great thing about naming your range is that if you need to add or remove items from your list, you can simply update the range and your drop down list will automatically update. And there you have it, you've successfully created a dynamic drop down list in Excel using data validation and a named range. If you want to create a drop down list with a few specific options like yes or no, you can manually enter the data directly in the data validation settings yes, comma, no, and you click OK. And your drop down list will now have yes and no as options. Drop-down lists are a great way to ensure data consistency and accuracy in your spreadsheets. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, and hit the bell icon to get notified of our latest videos. Thanks for watching and have a good day.